Pittsburgh is kicking off first, and we're ready to get this game underway. He sends this one deep. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. He airs it out. Oh, and he can't hold on. Number nine was the intended receiver on the way. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 25. And he throws it away. He wants it all going long. Missed him. Brad, you imagine being the offensive coordinator right now? Your quarterback is out of sync. He's not making the throws. Now you're facing a pivotal fourth down, and you've got a quarterback in an offense that's struggling. What are you going to do? They bring him down, and they bring him down hard on that one. Pittsburgh's coaching staff, they know they've got a star wide receiver. They know it's going to be a hostile environment. With that, we went to practice this week, Kirk. They had a crowd noise pumped up pretty good getting them ready for this game. Yeah, they've done everything that they can do to get this offense ready for a tough environment. They had the crowd noise all week long, making it tough to communicate for the quarterback and his receivers. Now it's here. Now it's the game. We'll see if all that preparation pays off. One thing we know for sure, they want to get the football into the hands of this receiver early and often if they want to win this game. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 48-yard line. Gains his way to the 40-yard line. That makes it second and two. Up the middle for a nice game. That's around five yards gain there on the play for the tailback. Again, they go with the halfback here, and again, he picks up some positive yardage and a first down. From the 35-yard line, first down. He gets to about the 27-yard line. That brings up second and one. Right, side right, side right. Four down, four down. Choose the mic. Take go. He has some room. Gains his way to the 19-yard line. Gain of eight on the play. First down. From the 19-yard line, it's first down. Mike two, Mike two. Go. Two, 68. Take go. Two, 68. Take go. Just throws this one away. Great job by the defense at getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. Mike, two. Watch two. Watch two. Go. Go. Now they They'll bring him down at about the 11. That's a team. That makes it third and They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. On the ground, and he is hammered. That's a great play by the defense. There's nothing like a defense being able to slip off of a block, get into the backfield of the offense, and then make a play in the backfield to be able to create some momentum possibly for this defense. It's up, and it is good. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And they can forget about returning this one. The Panthers are right where they want to be early in this one, partner. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Got it and brought down immediately.
second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. He lets it fly. Drops it. Makes the catch and look out. Brought down at about the 47 yard line. It's a great job here by the quarterback of recognizing the outside linebacker blitz and delivering the football for a first down. From their own 47 yard line. First down. Defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. And they make the stop at the 38-yard line. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 38. Gives it right side. Runs outside for a nice game. the 31. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. That makes it third and three. Get out! Going right to his tailback. Brought down to the open field. Gain of two yards. That'll bring up fourth and one. Down he goes at the 19-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on the 19-yard line. And they'll run him again. He's tackled at about the 9-yard line. Here's the 11th play of the drive. And he shoved out of bounds at the nine. Somebody hit the upset alert button because this one looks like it just might be heading in that direction. Three nothing, Panther. And we welcome you back to the action here and we have got a tight one going on in quarter number two. He's pushed out of bounds around the five-yard line. 13th play of the drive coming up. That brings up second and goal. Tries to scramble, but he's sacked. Perfect time to call the blitz. Took a bit of a chance, but it paid off by the linebacker being able to get through there, shoot the gap, and get to the quarterback. Well, it's third and goal, and they're 10 yards out. Down. And he's taken down at the nine-yard line. Gain of two on the play. That brings us fourth and goal. Louisville is down three and looking to tie it up. 
Kicks up, and they tack on three points. And you got to think they're pretty happy with holding them to a field goal right there. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. And he's tackled at the 27-yard line. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on their own 27. He's to the 40. Gets to around the 42. Did you see how much space there was for that tailback up front? He better be thanking his offensive lineman for that. Sack. Sometimes it's just a relentless pass rush that results in a sack. And that's what happened there. They come up to the line here in second down and 14 after the sack. Tackle around the 44-yard line. The 44 yard line. line. That'll, That'll bring, bring up, up third, third and eight. eight. Hey, right, Roger, Roger. Four down, four down. Mike, two. Watch two. Watch two. Go. Quick release. Tight end. Incomplete. Excellent punt. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. They've been like a couple of fighters feeling each other out so far. Let's see if they start to open it up a little bit more now. Going long. And he hauls it in. And he scores! Touchdown! And he converts the extra point. They're ready for the kick. He just drills this one. And they can forget about returning this one. The Panthers struggling trying to get their star wide receiver in this game. And sometimes, you know, Herbie, it's almost like uh, a jump shooter in basketball. Get him to the free throw line. Get him one free one from 15 feet and see how it can do. they got to get the ball in his hands somehow. I agree with you 100%. I mean, it's just a matter of just one play. One touch could get this guy going because he has that kind of ability. And up to this point, they've not been able to find a way to get him the ball. Give credit, a lot of credit to this defense for coming in with a good plan. But now it's up to the offense to make their own adjustments to kind of counter that attack by this defense to be able to get the, the ball into the hands of their go-to guy. Got it. And he goes down quickly. Call it a gain of six yards. That'll, That'll make it make third and one. one. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. Four down, four down. Check number six, check number six. Mike, two. Watch two. Run, 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 run. Nice run up the middle. With the run. Gain, Gain of six, of six yards. yards. First down. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. 
choose the mic. Makes it out to maybe the 40-yard line. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. One thing about this linebacker over the years that separates him from the rest are his instincts and ability to make the play. That's a nice tackle by the senior. Quick shot to the tight end, and he can't pull it in. Third down now, and they need to get it out to the 50. Got it, but knocked out of bounds for a short loss. That brings us to the He puts it away, and it's a great kick. From the 15. Both offenses have played it pretty close to the best so far in this one. Yeah, because they've been so conservative, it's made it pretty easy for both of these defenses to be pretty dominant. Let's see an offense open it up and take a few chances. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Now he's flushed and they got it. Man, these guys can be aggressive. When you stand back there and take hits like that, you definitely are going to feel it the next day. They find themselves in a hole here after that sack. It's second and long. He's on the run. Loose football. Scoops it up. He's taken down at the 16. That's a big break for this defense. You know, this offense just can't afford to be getting hit with a turnover bug. They need to hold on to the football. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Pittsburgh's going to have to use their second time out of the half. From the 11-yard line, second down. Quickly to the tight end, incomplete. Quick throw, almost intercepted. Fourth down, this should be an easy field goal. He gets it up, and he's got it. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Louisville is up by four. Quick out to his receiver. Tackle made at the 31-yard line. So it's second down now. They need about four yards to pick up the first. Gets rid of it quickly. And it's incomplete. Number 18 was the intended receiver on the right way. That'll bring up third and four. Pittsburgh will use their final timeout. Great job here in shutting down the run. That's a real boost for this team. It's away, and it's a booming punt. He fields it at the 17. 
Tackle at the 30-yard line. You know, this offense is doing a pretty good job moving the football. The problem is they're not coming up with touchdowns. The offense coordinator who's been up here next to us, Brad, the booth next to us, he's actually just taken off his headsets, and I think he's going down to the field to be next to the quarterback and the rest of this offense to try to engage with them to realize how important it is to finish these drives. Gets out to about the 31. Quick strike, and he drops it. The wide receiver wasn't able to hang on. Well, you talk about a solid hit. This guy is a true enforcer. Third and nine. Ball on the 31-yard line. He airs it out. The defender had his hands on it, but it's incomplete. made at the 35-yard line. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Louisville is up four. Throws in a hurry. And it's intercepted. And who else? It's the senior safety. And that was just an outstanding pick. Great play by the defender to high point the ball, but the quarterback wasn't in rhythm on the throw. First and 10. Ball on the 40. I guess he'll throw this one as far as he can and hope for a miracle. They'll make the sack. We played a half of football. The Cardinals lead 10-6. We've played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Defense has been dominant in this game. Yards very hard to come by. But David, as we get deeper and deeper into this game, the natural assumption is that the pressure goes to the offense to do something. No. How much pressure is on the defense not to make that catastrophic mistake? Well, that, that's, the, that's the conundrum you get in. I mean, it makes it exceptionally tough because you want to play perfect, and you want to get them to punt every single time, but it's not the way it works. And it's those big plays that you usually see that kill the defenses and break their backs. And you can hold them great, Reese, on first down, second down, it's third and long. You're in a perfect situation. You give up that one play for 80, and it changes the whole complexion of the game. So. I think you got to have a little bit of both. It can't just be great defense the whole time. Usually the teams that play great defense can keep you in it, but only for so long. At some point, that offense has to get something going. That's going to do it at halftime. Just about ready to start the second half. All right, you finish it up, brother. I'm going to get something in the cafeteria. I'm hungry. But, look, wait, don't leave until you get my order. Brad Kirk, take the second half. Welcome back, everybody. Second half action about to begin. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Louisville's coaching staff will go out tonight, and I think the offensive coordinator should buy the defensive coordinator his meal. Well, the defense has been great. There's no doubt about it. But I just think that the offense that they're facing, has just been so conservative, so predictable. It's made it very easy for this defense to have a dominant game. They'll bring him down at the 41-yard line. That makes it first and 10. ten. From their own 41-yard line, it's first down. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. Even though they didn't 
didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 49. That'll make it fourth down, and they're going to have to punt. The defense held their ground on that play. The quarterback just wasn't able to find any open receivers. He really got a hold of that one. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. We're about set to start things up again. Louisville holds a four-point lead. He makes it out to maybe the 20-yard line. A yard, if that, on the quarterback keeper. That makes it second and 10. Second and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. They'll knock him down for a loss. That is a loss of four yards. That makes it third and eleven. Quick throw. Incomplete. Almost picked off. You like a team that's ready to defend the pass. It takes some preparation to get in the way of a pass like that. He's tackled at the 50. Nice yardage on the run back. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. And down he goes at about the 23-yard line. First down. From the 23 yard line. First down. Three down, three down. Mike, two. Watch two. Watch two. Hands it off inside. Brought down. to his tight end, nothing doing. Nice defensive play that time. The key to this play defensively is the timing of the hit. Watch how he got in there right when the ball arrived and broke it up. That's a good play. It's third down and 11 to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. At back screen, incomplete. It has the distance, and it's good! Pittsburgh to kick. He sends this one deep. Pittsburgh's the team that nobody gave a chance today, but they're right where they want to be. I think just the mindset of this football team, they need to be complimented for that because it's easy to come in, be a bit intimidated, be a bit overwhelmed. They put that to the side, gone out and executed, and I think the longer they've stayed in this game, the more confidence that it's instilled. And he's tackled at the 35. Not a bad little play there. Yeah, this is a nice job by the quarterback reading the coverage and delivering a very catchable ball and allowing his receiver to come up with a nice game. It's second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. Louisville with a one-point lead. He's on the run. He's tackled right around the 48-yard line.
Michael at the 34. From the 34-yard line, first down. He's taken down around the 25 yard line. That brings up second and one. Gets it out quickly. And he's immediately tackled. First down there on a five yard pass. And still, this gunslinger hasn't missed a receiver yet on this drive. From the 20 yard line. It's first down. And they make the stop at the 10. the five yard line. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Louisville is up one. Ball is loose, fumble. The defense falls on it. So the offense turns over the pigskin. The ball carrier here was just careless in handling the ball. And a great awareness by the defense to jump Previous on it. They're going to review this game. fumble, and I've got to tell you, I think he was down before the ball popped loose. I don't know about this one, Brad. They called it a fumble on the field, and they need indisputable video evidence to overturn this call. After, After review of the, the play, play, the ruling, ruling on, the on the field, field is reversed. Is reversed. So after review, they decide that this call should be reversed. So here we go. It's third and goal from the two-yard line. Defense and their short yardage package. They go with the run, and they stopped him. That is a loss of one yard. That brings us fourth and goal. The kick is up, and they tack on three points. Looks like they're ready for the kick. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Up the middle and he's stuffed. From their own 23 yard line. Second down. And now the ball is loose. And no one can get it. It bounces out of bounds. Through three quarters now. And still the defenses are shining. 13-9, Louisville. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. We might look back on this game when it's all over and say that's the point where they won the football game with that stop. They look like they've got the block on, and this offensive line's got to give him some time. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. And he makes it out to about the 31-yard line. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. Louisville is up by four. And a 
big hit. He stopped in his tracks. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 35. Taken down at the 50 yard line. We've got a first and ten, ball on the 50. Made at the 42. That makes it second and two. Gives it off. He gets hit out of bounds around the 36 yard line. Decent game there on the play by the running back, and that's enough for the first. Good running and a strong push to get into the second level of that defense. He tackles him for a loss. Lost the five on the way. That makes it second and 14. Second down and 14. Ball on the 41. at the 30. Knocked out of bounds. Right around the 22-yard line. From the 22-yard line, first down. Less than three minutes in the game. on the run inside the 10 huge play and it's going to be first and goal now the defense knew that this offense was trying to work the clock when you want to work the clock you're going to run the football it puts a lot of pressure on the offensive line to get low and drive that defense. touchdown cardinals
Here's the call from the referee. Delay of game, Delay of game. Offense. offense. Just under two minutes in the game. And he hits the PAT. They line up to kick this one away. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Well, I'm sure the return man would have loved to go for six that time. Well, we're under two minutes to go in this game, and this offense is down by two possessions. The defense knows that if they can come up with another stop, this game is over. Caught, and he's hit immediately. He's out of bounds, right around the 32-yard line. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. Three down, three down. Choose the mic. They'll bring him down around the 49-yard line. He looked pretty cool back there. Even with the outside linebacker blitzing, he made an accurate throw, and the result is a new set of downs. the cornerback. Oh, that is one dejected quarterback. That interception is going to seal this game. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 13. Panthers call a timeout. That's their second of the half. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. He was playing the run all the way and was able to stop him quickly. Good job by that senior safety. Just over a minute left. And he carries the ball for a nice game. About four yards and a counter to the halfback. The Panthers, they're going to have to call their third and final timeout. Makes a catch, and he's got nowhere to go. That'll bring up fourth and one. Excellent punt. He makes it out to maybe the 36-yard line. I'm sure there are a lot of fans out there hoping for a miracle, but I seriously doubt we're going to see one today. Just throws this one away. It's second and ten. Ball on their own 36. He's going to air it long. That close to being intercepted. It can be tough making a play on the ball sometimes, but that's probably a pick he should have made. Going long. He's got his receiver with nobody around him. Touchdown, Pittsburgh! Late in the fourth quarter now, and with that score, this game's a one-possession ball game, and it's really going to get tense from here on out. Well, they're going to try for the two-point conversion. Needed that play, and he dropped it. 
So a short three play 64 yard drive and they get six points on the board after failing the two point conversion. And he's taken down at the 43. So not a lot of time left and they've got an opportunity right now if they score to put the nail in the coffin in this game. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. He'll go down to one knee. It's final. A close one to the very end. Louisville 20, Pittsburgh 15. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long.